With the Easy Worship Remote app for iOS, you can control your Easy Worship schedule from the stage or anywhere within your Wi Fi range, or simply view the live output on your iOS mobile device. The Easy Worship Remote app can be downloaded from the iOS App Store. To begin, you'll need to connect the remote app to Easy Worship. So make sure both your iOS device and the computer are connected to the same local area network. Open Easy Worship, and if you don't see the remote icon on the main toolbar, click the Edit menu, then Options, and go to Advanced on the left. Scroll to the bottom of the page and check the box to enable remote control under the remote control settings. Make note of the computer name that appears so you know which computer to select from your mobile device. If you want to use a different computer name, select that field and change the name. Click OK. Now you'll see the remote icon on the main toolbar. If you see a red X in the center, click the icon and change the toggle button to say ON. If you see a green dot, it's on and ready to be connected. Open the Easy Worship app on your mobile device and tap Settings. Then tap Server. Select the name of the computer you're connecting to. A message will appear that says not paired, waiting for your computer name to pair. Go back to the computer and now you'll see a yellow triangle on the remote icon. Select it and click the pair button next to the mobile device that's trying to connect. If it paired successfully, the entire remote icon should now be green, meaning you're connected to the mobile device. Click Remote to see the connection. By default, the mobile device will be locked, which means that you'll only be able to view the schedule and live output and won't have any control. You'll see it says View Only next to Connection Status on the mobile device. If you want the user to have full control from the mobile device, click the lock symbol to unlock it. You'll also need to make sure the Enable Output Control on the mobile device is turned on to be able to control Easy Worship. Tap Done. The layout for an iPad, which I'm using here, shows the live output in the top left corner with the schedule below it and the live window for slide selection is on the right. The logo, black, and clear buttons are in the top right corner. The view will be slightly different when using an iPhone. To navigate the schedule, tap the schedule item you want, then tap the slide that you want live on the right. You can also swipe the live output left or right, or tap the forward or back arrows to advance the slides. Use pinch to resize the thumbnails in the live window. Go to full screen by tapping the double arrow in the live output window. And from there, tap the hamburger icon to view and control the schedule item. Tap close to exit full screen. Download the remote app for Easy Worship from the iOS App Store today to get the flexibility and control you've been looking for. Thanks for watching and thanks for choosing Easy Worship.